Hi everyone, I'm just doing some maintenance on my paints here and I just wondered if everyone else does this. For the most part, I feel all my paints, whether they be um, the small little Games Workshop ones or the really big tubs like this with a couple of magnets and these are little ball magnets. You can get them off um, you know, like eBay and so forth, you know, a thousand for five bucks and so forth. And people will say to me, well, why not just use normal ball bearings or use, you know, glass balls and so forth. And the reason is, quite simply, the magnetism. So if I picked up this paint and I didn't know if it had mag magnets in it or not, I can just quickly pop it underneath and see if it's got magnets. And sure enough, yes, it's, I've just put magnets in it. Now, the reason why I put magnets in it also is the fact of, as you can see, this is not really good. This is all congealed down the bottom and it's got gunk on top. So what I can do is I can just take it from there and just give this a little run round on the bottom, just running it around just to help some of that gunk sort of just move around a little bit, just to get the ball rolling. Now, like all ball bearings, magnetized or otherwise, you know, it'll um, help shake it up. But I find this just to help break up, and I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but it's actually moving the gunk around inside there as well. So it's just breaking it all up pretty much from the inside. And now, once it's all done up and it's all starting to, you know, starting to get a bit more coloration like it used to be before, I can then just take that off, give it a good shake, and let's see how we do. Look at that, the glory of magnets. I hope this little uh, tip is handy for you. I mean, you can use normal bar ball bearings, I guess, and use a magnet underneath, but, you know, I got a ton of these. You know, a magnet on magnet, just the strength increases. You can just spin it around, and away we go. Anyway, I hope this helped you out, and I will use that just as much with, you know, inks and washers as well, just to help get the ball rolling a little bit every now and again. All right? And it does work with the bigger ones as well. Um, there you go, it's on the bottom there, and I can just hold it up like that and spin it around and so forth. Same process. Everyone have a great day. Bye-bye.